I'm Jake Montalvo with the Harlingen Jiu-Jitsu Club, and this is Valley Tudor's Technique of the Week. I'm here with Patrick Chansey, Harlingen Jiu-Jitsu Club Blue Belt. We're going to be showing the wizard control to lapel choke, also arm bar, also from wizard control. All right, the first thing is you're going to start off in a real common position, the close guard. I want to make sure that I get a cross grip on my opponent, so opposite hand's going to come to the sleeve. Folding the sleeve, making sure it's a real strong grip. I want to get my, my free hand underneath my opponent's wrist here, and what I'm going to start to do is use my legs to come forward and open the grip up, bringing my opponent's weight forward. Wrapping around the arm, making sure my, my left elbow is tight to my body, gripping to the, my, uh, my opponent's opposite lapel. Once I get this control, I can let go of the beginning grip and make adjustments here to make sure I have a real tight grip on my opponent's lapel. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use my feet to hip out, create some angle. I'm gonna close my guard back up, use my free hand to reach for my opponent's shoulder right here, using the blades of my wrist, I'm gonna squeeze everything in, get the lapel choke from wizard control. Okay. Still going. Still from the same position, I'm gonna work for the cross grip again. I'm gonna get underneath, bring my opponent forward, get my grip on the lapel. Right here is a loose, loose grip. I can use my opposite hand to adjust. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and make a, a hip out movement here, putting my foot all the way to my opponent's hip. Okay, other foot, I'm gonna stab into my opponent's opposite hip. Now I need to make sure my knee is above his shoulder. I'm gonna start to pinch my knees together, isolating the arm, creating an arm bar here. I'm Jacob Montalvo with the Harlingen Jiu-Jitsu Club. Visit us at www.harlingenjjc.com. And that was Valley Tudor's Technique of the Week.